Come on, she deserves it. It is not her fault that she has a huge crush on my Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Just because he's class pres doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em, I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. weekend. Josh. Jeez, Josh. Once again, brother, you've outdone us all. Mm. Oh my God. What did our naive sister get herself into now? I got your note. I'm glad you can make it. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, picking out and see where it goes from there. Oh, hell yeah. Oh my God. She's taking her shirt off. What? Oh my God. Matt, what are you doing here? Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. It's all got out of hand. Just a stupid prank. Uh, Hey, you guys are jerks. You know that? Hannah! <gasps> guys! There's someone outside. What's going on? Where's my sister going? It's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We are just messing around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Hannah! So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike.
Hello? Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. Anna, that Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It, it is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Okay. Honesty is good. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? Well, I see. I see. Let's see. The scarecrow were not there. Would you feel comfortable staying there on your own for a period of time? Let's say a week, for example.
Oh no? Why not? There's a fine line between the peacefulness of solitude and the loneliness of isolation. Perhaps this is something we can explore in the future. Hmm? Because I'm afraid we're out of time. <laughs> Not for now. Until the next session. And uh, until then, try to surround yourself with friends in a place that makes you feel safe. Today is the one-year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. Listeners, an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, with their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this. And I, I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together. And I'm thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes!
what? Bella, you hungry? Huh? <laughs> Cutie. <laughs> cool. all the way up here. Chris, are you here? The bag's here, where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Hello, what do we have here? Sam, hey, you made it. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. Get a visit from America's most wanted? Looks like someone thought so. Oh, come on. This place is abandoned most of the year. Nobody comes up here. Ta da! Pretty rad, right? Yeah! Come on. Look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? What the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. All right, here goes.
Wow, nice shooting, Tex. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. No, nah, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. <laughs> nice shot. Your ass just got sacked. <sighs> hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Man, it is. It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. Yeah, I swear the moment I got here, it just all came flooding back. Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. Gentlemen. What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. They're not so rich. They only bought a mountain. Car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm trying to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? It's a big mountain. Yeah. It's so beautiful in the day, but at night just feels menacing. Like Stay here and catch some disease, but okay. Just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right, adventure begins. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, get everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I don't know, I'm kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro, good talk. <laughs> you know what, let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what, you're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap-snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her train bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect.
boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Hey. Jessica, over here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look. I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh -huh. Hey! <laughs> well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? Chris! My goodness! Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Oh. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <sighs> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? I don't think it would have been like as pretty. No. And where's the bellboy when you need one? <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely not gonna feel like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? Ah! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Cool. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out, otherwise this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't wanna make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trip. All right. See you, man. See ya. All right. See ya! Oh, crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, just all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Em, I really don't think you should head back down the trail by yourself. Seriously? 
Seriously? It's cold out and it's getting dark. You're gonna protect me from it being dark out? I'll just leave your stuff here and come with you. Nobody's gonna steal it. Matt, are you kidding me? You can't leave me alone for five minutes? You really think that little of me? That's not what I meant. Why can't you just listen to me? Why do you have to question everything I say? I'm sorry, Em. I'm just trying to be helpful. If you want to be helpful, then you can help get everything up to the lodge as quickly as you can, okay? Uh, okay. Fine. Whatever you want. Thank you. I'll see you up there after I go find Sam. See you in a bit. Hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Oh! oh God. <laughs> Hi. Oh. Hey, whoa. <sighs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey, wow. Well. Man, I'm not really sorry, Ash, Dan. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it... Let me check it out. Uh, um, sure, uh, go, go ahead. Knock yourself out, I guess. Oh, well, son of a bitch. Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I... God damn it. Matt. Not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. The hell am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? Oh, sneaky, sneaky. <laughs> Thing! Crap. Gotta try harder than that, hero. Where are you hiding, little chickadee? Crap! Hey! Oh, snap! Hello? <laughs> hey, Mike! Boom, shakalaka! Okay. can't hide from me, Michael. Whoa! Wow. Wow. Right. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right, all right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Ah! Oh, ho, ho. okay. 
Okay, you're really gonna get it. What am I gonna get? Well, I can think of at least one thing. Yeah. But you'll have to wait until later. We should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. Trust that you have stayed in the company of good friends since our last session. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Did I startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. I think this is a little 
little bit. Oh, come on. She deserves it. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. No! Shut up! First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Son of a bitch. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh, yeah? That feels the same to me. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, and I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey, guys. Get up here okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it is so good to see you. What's up with him? Yo, yo, yo. We get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Hey, you doing all right? I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always used to. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's got to be like a window around the corner we can get, like, get open or something. Wait a second, are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Hi, Chris. So, how are you doing? Mm, good, but... A little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. season, huh? Yeah. Something like that. Hey, you okay, man? Some people, you know? You think you know them? Okay. So, oh. see Nash yet? Um, yeah. Oh, cool, cool. How's, uh, how's she doing? She's fine. Why? No reason. She was looking pretty hot today, right? She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Hey, 
cut it out, man. Yeah, I mean, you're not gonna bang her. Maybe Michael take up the case. Wait, will you back off already? Relax. Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. Yeah. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Maybe you're right. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Jeez. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Cochise, or else you got four lovely ladies who are gonna be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. pretty low on juice here. I just gotta turn off my GPS. I'm finally like outside where I might actually use it. Can you cool it on the phone, Tom? Huh? Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. Well, what, what is it? Okay, so... I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I gotcha. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the Lormy dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye, frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. Huh? 
hell was that? Very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be like getting the lock open or something? On it. Freezing our buns off out here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> 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 
shirt! <laughs> ah, crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Make yourself at home, bro. Will do. Yeah. Come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway. Right? Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. What the hell were you doing with M out on the trail? What? I saw you and M. Through the telescope. Before? We just ran into each other. It's been a while, so we hugged and I said hello. Is that against the law? Right. Yeah. Duh. Sorry, it's been kind of a long day. I overreacted. Nah, man. Don't worry about it. Be cool? Yeah, yeah, totally. Oh my god, that is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Um, I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. Cuts real deep calling Miss Homecoming a cow. You're making everyone uncomfortable, Jess. Jealous much? Emily too frigid for you too. Hey, that's that's uncalled. Look, whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0, bitch. Honor roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. <laughs> Are you serious? Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Stop. This is out of hand. There's no reason to fight like this. Yeah, Em. Why are you picking fights over your ex-boyfriend, huh? Stop it! This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. Okay, if we can't get along for 10 minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. You wanna go do that? Any place without that whore. It's right up the trail. Glad that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the, the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, do I... Do you? 
guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm? We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. <sighs> Exiled. Sexiled. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, bar. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> If we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars. I'm gonna need these. Porn star? I paid to see you. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right, roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay, you wanna invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. Photo booth? All right, read my mind. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy, and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. Wink. Noted. <sighs> Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And how are you gonna do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. Not a lot of TLC for this place anymore. Kind of a bummer. Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. I think you bring out the worst in her. Is that so? Epic jealousy. Suck it. Nice one, Mikey. Woo! You are a wizard!
Shazam! The gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. No, this is awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hit. <laughs> Psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. Wow. Please. From Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. It's all such a blur. I can barely even remember what happened. Well, what I remember is that we played a stupid half-baked prank that probably got Hannah and Beth killed. Hey, I mean, it's not our fault they ran into the woods. Yeah. How could anyone have expected them to do a dumb thing like that? I don't think we can get up to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, a.k.a. Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. Ah! Ah! Jess! Fuck! Oh. Hey, Jessica! Yep. Hey. I'm okay. Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... Uh, I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. All right, coming after you. Just stay put. Hey, handsome. Want to help me move this cart thing? together. This is not what I pictured. the good kind of willies. Can I offer you a little comfort and reassurance? <laughs> we'll save it for the cabin, Buster.
Shinogi's. Weird place to hang out and smoke cigars. <laughs> it's recent. Wonder who's out there. Whoa. This place is like historical. Holy bat cave. He's gotta be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting their arts and crafts on, no. <laughs> No, no, it's like a shrine or something. A shrine to what? Fixer rubber. Cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> Where do you see the Lincoln bedroom? Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Uh, take a ride on Air Force One? <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stump speech. Oh, a telescope! Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Uh, whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Hey, Jess? Mm-hmm? Stay close by, okay? What's up? Uh, this posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Oh, Michael, I have the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. Come on, please. Come on. Let's not hug a bear. Okay.
just, just answering his mating call. Wow, you're easy. Yeah, you've got a lot of love to give. <laughs> I'm scared. Josh, couldn't you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half-empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. <laughs> oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. Ah! Boo! Okay. Okay. That's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> yes! Sammy! What? You wanna help me get this fire going? Uh, well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? Hardy R. Come on. All right, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge. about Mike.
Yeah, totally. Woohoo! Let's go, Josh. Let's go. crazy place we used to have a spirit board a what wow you have a spirit board <laughs> yeah yeah they're fun right those things are a joke man they don't do shit no way bro i mean we used to do it all the time me and well hey, josh no hot water's kind of major oversight don't you think yeah Ooh, yeah you just gotta fire up the boiler it's in the basement all right you guys see if you can find the spirit board chris let's go find it It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um, okay. Guess so. Brad, I mean, you're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over, you know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> Josh? I just wanted to say... Uh, what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that you came, Sam. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this. Together. Um... I want us to have a good time, you know? Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Sorry to drag you down into the bowels. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. Rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it, it wasn't. 
in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, dad, my sisters. It was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Can't go back. New reality, right, Sam? Anyway, I'm supposed to be fixing this whole guy, right? Here, can you, can you hold this? What was that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Hey, can you just keep the light so I can see, okay? Nice one. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mm, sounds kinda complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. Ah, oh, damn. It's okay. I'm just... Try again. Ah! Relax. It's not that hard. Just press the button when the light comes okay, on. Okay, okay, okay. I'll get it this time. Sure. better than that to freak me out, all right? Wait, okay, so you hear that too, right? Josh. What? The rest of it's like weirdly regular. Not, not, nothing regular about it. or some problem with the furnace. Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. This 
cool old movie crap down here. What was I? Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you? Are you serious? Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared, admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're going to take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. I would like to understand your feelings toward people of fear, isolation, Loneliness. Do you share this fear? Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you are playing your game. Now is it? investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person, loyalty or honesty? So, you would tell the truth even if it resulted in an unpleasant outcome for a friend. And what about honesty then, and charity? <sighs> charity is overrated, I suppose. Better to be true to yourself than to help others in need, eh? Well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedies of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, you know, thinking of them. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me with your sluttiness? Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah, yeah, all right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> Jess! So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. Okay, then. Let's see what happens. 
Ashley, since you're a recent convert, why don't you be our medium for today? Okay. Um, is anyone there? Will you reveal yourself to us if you're there? <laughs> Wait a minute. Did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear, it's just moving. Holy shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. Who are you? Oh. oh. Here it goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. E. R. Sister. Sister? Who's sister? Oh, come on. Is this for real? Shut up. Ask it who's sister. Josh, it's, it's gotta be. Yeah, okay, well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. are we speaking to? Hannah? Is that you? Oh, God. This is messed up. Josh, are you? Fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No. Dude, it, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. I don't know where to start. Think about it. If this is actually Hannah, I mean, we can find out what happened that night. Josh? I can handle it. Okay. Um, let me think. Hannah, if you can hear this, like, really hear this, we all want to apologize for what happened. It, it was stupid and, and mean and we're sorry. We're so sorry, Hannah. B? E? T? R? Uh-oh. I don't like this. Betrayed. What does she mean? Oh, it, it's still going. Oh, God. K? I? L? L? E? No! Kill. We didn't kill them! It was just a prank! A Ash, calm, calm down, okay? Just, we, we, we need to find out more. I'm sorry, I am guys, so guys, sorry! What, what do they mean? Ask them what, what happened. It's, it's, the, it's the only way to know. Ask them, Ash. Okay. Who killed you? Hannah, who was it? L, I, B. The library. Maybe there's something in the library B here. R, O, O. Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library. Oh, no. ah! Holy shit, Chris. You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen, I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no! You wanted to use the spirit board! Hey, hey calm down. It's, it's not actually. I don't need this right now, okay? You guys are full of it! Sh should we go after him? Ah, man, I, I mean, he'll be okay. Let's, let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. I mean, if, if you were faking it, if you were doing one hell of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. Yes? <coughs> Jess? Jess?
Jess, where did you go? This is not funny. Jessica, oh, come on. Jess. Buddy, you in there? Whoa! Christ! I scared the blue out of my jeans. <laughs> the hell is that doing in there anyway? Jess? Hun? Light of my life? This is not funny. I totally promise I won't murder you. Oh! Oh my god. No. <laughs> that was so good. Not, no. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You have to see those. You have to I'm not record. seeing it. No. No. no, no, no. <laughs> you recorded that? <laughs> Look at your face. <laughs> I was scared, oh Jed. You can't just jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. It's scary. I'm sorry. Don't I'm, scare you. If we send that to anybody, <gasps> you what? gonna kill you. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like scream, Michael. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you scared the pants off of them. As far as I can tell, my pants are still on. Oh, is that so? Yeah. Looks like you have to try harder. A challenge, eh? Well, I hope you're strapped in, because you're about to feel the full force of my mind melting skills. Well, well, well. Look at this fun little lovebird carving. An M and an E. Any idea what that could stand for? Oh, could be any, you know, Elizabeth and in, in my room. <laughs> or maybe Michael and Emily. Relax. I just didn't realize you were so sappy. Pun intended. I came up here with them last year, but seriously, do you, I look like the kind of guy who carves hearts on trees. <laughs> I wouldn't have pegged you for a sissy screamer either, but can you ever really know a person? It had to be Emma. She can get all gross and mushy. Yeah, sure, sure.
Charming. It's everything you described, Michael. Wait, what? The cabin. I love it. Yeah. Buddy. God, the poor thing. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Mike, it's in so much pain. It'll be over soon. Okay, buddy. It'll be over soon. Ah! Ah! Run! Run! Oh my God, what the hell was that? I don't know! Oh, there's a friend! Over here, over here! Mike, get over here! Go. I am! 
sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? Okay. Well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is going to open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh. Typical. Urgh. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. My yeah. fire and mood lighting. Yes, my lady. <sighs> nice. This will lighten up the mood a little. Are you okay? What are you doing? It's, it's the lights. I know it's the lights, dummy. You broke them. It's probably faulty wiring or something. You've got faulty wiring. Ah, this will take care of the mood lighting. Friendly neighborhood terror bears. That does not make me feel any better. Oh, Jess! Look at this! Is it a fire? No, way cooler. Never understand what we have together. Shit. Fuck, Mike. What? Oh, crap. What? Where is it? What? What's wrong? Gone. It is gone, okay? Yes. Slow down. What is gone? My freaking phone, Sherlock. Can't find it? Crap, no. I must have dropped it outside. Oh, shit. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay, okay. Well, I'll have you look for it. It's got to be outside. Yeah, I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. Fine. Looky, looky. Who's gonna fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you?
Man one, fire zero. Very nice. Bravo. All right, my lady. What comes next? It's your phone. What? How is it my phone? I don't know. It just came through the window. Oh, for fuck's sake. God damn it. What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business. they were if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. Josh looked really freaked out at the seance. Yeah, I mean, he, he looked like he was keeping it together, but... Do you think we shouldn't have mentioned his sisters? I mean, it's why we came back up here. Yeah, but not to, like... Have a seance? Maybe we went too far.
What is that? Is it a button? Why would there be a button? That's a good question. Should I push it? That's what buttons were for, I guess. Hope it's a rom com. Leave it to the Washingtons to have secret passages in their house. I mean, maybe they didn't even know this place is super old. So, should we take a look? Yeah, after you. No, 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 no. You go. <sighs> Gee, thanks. What did you find? Holy cow. Now, Ash, I, I, I don't want to freak you out, but, but look at this. What? Chris, what is that? I... I think this might be what the spirit board wanted us to find. The clue? Yeah, it's a letter. Let me see it. It's a, a threat. Chris, this is serious. We need to find Josh right now. actually after Hannah and Beth? If so, that would be really messed up. Looks like it was written by Josh's mom. Yeah, she's really making an effort to set things right with some native tribe or something. Yep, the bad karma goes back a long way. So, um, I've just been thinking about something I saw earlier with Sam. What? It, there was like this wanted poster, like full on Western style, you know? So? And Sam really thought there was someone following her around. So, so what you're saying, there's some criminal up on the mountain with us? I mean, maybe that's whoever was down in the basement before. What? Under the floorboards in the library, the light. Well, there was that guy I told you whoa, whoa, about. Wait, 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 what guy? The guy who threatened the Washingtons. I mean, he, he said he wanted to take revenge by burning the whole place down. And then I found that crazy psycho letter. Chris, if this is your way of trying to make me feel better, you're fired. <gasps> you hear that? That was Josh. Oh, it's coming from the kitchen. Oh. Josh! Josh! Oh. He's coming! Hold on! Ashley! Are you okay? I'm gonna... Ash? Ash?
I'm going to show you some uh, pictures of people that you have come to know. Maybe you don't like them as much as you pretend to. Well, this is an exercise in honesty. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take your time, your answers are important. Tell me, in this little game you're playing so diligently, who is it that you most dislike? A bit too bitchy for your taste. Often the lack of confidence manifest itself as overconfidence. Think about that. Is that not just a little bit like? Oh, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. One individual we're considering as a person of interest. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. Apparently he had warned them against pursuing their construction project in Blackwood Pines and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. S. I. S. T. Sister? Ask it whose sister? Josh, it's it's gotta be. Which sister is it then? Ah! Run! Ah! Oh. oh my god. Yes.
Jessica, I'm coming! I'm coming!
Ash. Ash! Good. Not good at all. Okay. Oh, shit. No. Ashley! Ashley? Anyone out there, Ashley?
Ash. 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 Ashley. Ash. Ashley! Red! Uh, Ash, I'm here! Where are you? Hey! God damn it! Please! Help me! Uh, I'm coming, Ash. Just, uh, just keep talking to me. What happened? Ashley, I'm gonna get you out of this. Don't worry. I'm really scared, Chris. <laughs> Hurry, please. <gasps> Chris, are you there? Hello. <gasps> and thank you all for joining me. Wake up. Tonight, what? we're gonna what conduct this? a little experiment. <laughs> sort of test. Now, for this experiment, I We'll need the cooperation of our two test subjects, Joshua and Ashley. What? Oh my God! But we're gonna need one more brave participant to help decide which subject will live and which will die. Oh, no. oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Chris, oh, get us out of here! Let's please, go from here, you make please, it. please, everyone, calm down. It's all very simple. Christopher, you will find a lever placed directly in front of you. All you have to do is choose who you will save. Oh, no. Please, get me oh, out shit, of here. Shit, shit, no! Oh, my God, oh, God, this oh, is not right! Okay, 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 this is gonna be okay. Oh, oh dude, buddy, oh, let's just think God. about this for Chris, a minute. You can't let me die! Just, just give me a second, I, 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 uh, huh? I can't think straight, just... Huh? I'll get you out of this. I won't let you die. No. You. Thank you. No. This is insane. This is not. This is not happening. Chris, please. No. I see. You have chosen to save Ashley. No, Chris. No, 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 no,
I'm coming, Ash. I'm, I'm gonna get you. I'm running you down. Shh, shh, stop, please. Come on, come on, let's, let's, let's get no. you down. Come on, we're gonna get you out of here. No! We gotta go, okay? <laughs> Josh, Josh, what, dude? You said Wait, not what? right in front of us, man. What are you there's, talking there's about? There's a maniac. Maniac? Oh my God, we gotta get out of here. I don't understand what happened. There's a maniac, and he was there was a sign. It was either him or Ash, and I, I don't know what oh to God. do. It come right through my head, spilling out fucking everywhere. What? Oh my God, Chris! What? And I, I killed him. Oh, Chris. I, I, I him. It was my fault, man. No, no, this is insane. We need to go get some help. We go right in half. We're gonna figure this out. <laughs> Matt, we need to go get help now. And we should look for the others. Mike and Jess are off 69ing each other, and who knows where Sam is. I think she's in the lodge. Fine. Fine, you're right. Get everyone else together, but if there's a maniac running around, I think we need to get some help, too, right? Not just wait around. But what about... Why are we still talking about this? Let's go! These poor people are getting what they deserve! I'm trying to help you. And this game you're playing, you understand that it's not good for you. It's not good for anyone. And I can't say that you're being particularly honest in the way you're playing. Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. So have fun. Why would you do this? Jessica! Oh my god! Oh my god! Shit! There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? Jeez. That's not good. Yeah, 
That's really not good. Wouldn't I end up in the creepiest place on planet Earth?
That's different.
grass snooping around this paradise. This just gets better and better.
this a quaint little psycho crib.
can't believe Josh is dead. I can't believe how he died. No, I, I mean, what if they were wrong? What? Maybe we should have checked the shed to see if it was really true. I, I don't know. There are some things that once you see them, you can never unsee them. Yeah, I guess, but some things you have to see for yourself. I'll take their word for it. So fresh. I feel better with an axe. Now, this is locked, Matt. We'll break the door down, will ya? Whoa, wait a second. We start smashing shit down, he's gonna hear us. Well, you got any better suggestions? I don't know. What about... Look! What? The window. That's great, Matt. I can just about fit my lip balm through that little slot. Oh, come on. You will never fit through there, big guy. Fine. Here it goes. I'm gonna huff, and I'm gonna... Shh, just do it! to Chris and Ash and Josh? He's gotta know this is the only way back. Don't say that. Look, the cable car's all the way out there. Well, that's, I, I mean, that's not far, right? You, you can jump it? <laughs> I'm good, Em. But not that good. I'm flattered, though. Well, Matt, if you can't jump that, what are we gonna do? I, I don't know. Why, everything is, like, so busted up. I think they knew exactly what they were doing. Hey, look! Fire tower. Hey, Magellan, maybe we should get the cable car working and take the show on the road, huh? Friendly. Unfollow. <sighs>
him. That, that could work, but I, I kind of think that maybe we should get back to the lodge for now. Everyone, everyone's been split up for so long. Wait, for real? What is it with you and going back to the lodge? You just want to hide out in your room and cry. What? No. Don't be a pussy. We got to do this, Matt. Fine. Fine. Whatever you say. That's over. Yeah, for real. safe spot. Hold up. Wait it out. It, it'll be a lot easier to figure this all out in the morning. As long as we don't hide in the lodge, that's where he expects us to go.
Watch where you step around here. Yes, Matt. Given the choice, I prefer not to spend my evening plummeting to my death off a snowy cliff top. Clothes, really? Whichever one of you did this is off my Christmas list. Seriously, not cool, guys. Not cool at all. Chris? Josh? What the hell? Okay, it was all very funny. Haha. -ha. Look at Sam walking around in a towel, but now I just really want this to be over. All right? You had enough? to hang out in a towel for the rest of the weekend. Towel it is then. Okay, if you were trying to freak me out, guess what? You succeeded. Samantha. 
looking for me. I don't think you'll have much luck by looking, Samantha. You're only going to see what I want you to see. And I have quite a lot to show you. What is going on? Open your eyes. Oh my god. She's quite beautiful, isn't she? What are you doing out there? A beautiful bathing bird. Do you think she has any idea what lies ahead? Do you think these were the last happy moments of this creature's life? Showing this to me. Why are you watching? How does it make you feel? Oh my god, what did you do? I'm going to give you ten seconds. Nine. No, eight, no, 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 no! Seven. Please, no! Sam. Sam. Sam.
Well, that certainly didn't go according to plan. Now, did it? Such careful, brilliant plotting, and yet in a crucial moment, you are foiled by your own inadequacies. I told you that everything you do has consequences. Do you think this mistake won't have repercussions? What do you do and what you say causes things to change? Yes. Oh, the good work. We did exploring the source of your fear. And you've just gone and used it for ill. Mm -hmm. Your overwhelming fear of isolation. You have turned it against these people who you so desperately want to torment. Has it been worth it? God, we gotta get out of here. I don't understand what happened. There's a maniac. This is insane. We need to go get some help. Hello? Guys? Hello, Samantha. Looking for me? We should look for the others. Mike and Jess are off 69ing each other, and who knows where Sam is. I think she's in the lodge. Why are we still talking about this? Let's go. Hey, look. Fire tower. What is that? Uh, I don't know. <gasps> Matt, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Stay calm. Relax. They're just deer. This one. Check us out as all. No, 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 Matt. They're gonna hurt us. If we do manage to get someone on the radio, we will. then we tell them we need help. But what do we do while we wait? We go back to the lodge and get everyone else. Oh God, not the lodge. We should stay here in case whoever it is needs to get back in touch with us. Let's get that radio working first. Motion sensor, probably.
is it so windy all of a sudden? We're almost inside. Missing. After tonight, their disappearance is starting to make more sense. This might need it. Aye, aye, Captain. Beth.
you're out there, please, we need help. Over, over. Shit. Hello. Oh my god. Thank god, we need help, please. Hello, is someone trying to contact us? This is the Park Ranger Service for Blackwood County. I'm not getting your signal very well. Please speak slowly and clearly. Over. Please, 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 please help. Oh my god, we're stuck on Blackwood Mountain and there's a maniac. If you can hear this, please repeat your message as I'm unable to understand what you are saying. Please help, Over. please. Hello? Can you please identify yourself? Over. Now, will you please get me off this goddamn tower? Please, 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 Matt, just do something! Uh, 
Get a jump. Oh. Ah! Dad, Jesus! I'm just trying to, to find the safest way to get to you. You idiot, just get me out of oh. here! Oh. Oh. She wasn't up there? I don't know, I didn't see her. She must have come down here. I haven't seen her either. <laughs> Did that just happen? Damn it, what is going on around here? Chris. Is that what? Chris, I just want to say, what happened back there in the shed? I know how hard that was. Josh was your friend. Ashley, stop. No, I want to say, I mean, thank you. Thank you for saving my life. Ash, what was I going to do? Okay, I, I, I couldn't let anything happen to you. I couldn't. You all right? Yeah, I just. I know you and Josh were close, Chris. Let's just find Sam, okay? That, that's what we're doing. I mean, now. oh my God! Ashley, just stop, okay? I don't want to think about what just happened. Chris, we're finding Sam. Did I see what? That, Chris, that! What that was that? It was like, it was like a see-through shape, like a ghost. Oh, boy. I'm serious. Why don't you believe me? I said I saw it. Doesn't that count for anything? We, we've been through hell tonight, okay? Your mind is fried. My mind is fried. I, I don't even trust what I've been seeing. No, you are wrong. I saw it, and I am sure, Chris. All right, all right. Maybe, maybe it's, maybe you did see something. Let's just, let's just keep our heads. Are we going crazy down here? It, it's, it's the only place left Sam could be, Ash. I wish we could just go find everyone else and- What if Sam needs us? What if she's in trouble? Oh, God. <laughs> let's go. Josh in the shed. You can see in the you know, that, that's, See what? It's tiny furniture. No. 
It's a whole scene with dolls and everything. Yeah. I guess you need a key if you want to play around in there. There's no handle. out because of what happened with Josh. You're not paying attention. I saw it. I saw a ghost and it looked like Hannah. It looked wait, like wait, Hannah. Wait, 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 what? Pet. Jesus, Ash, what, what, what do you think? They followed us up here from the seance? I don't know, maybe. They didn't because ghosts don't exist, okay? Oh, okay, who was talking to us at the seance, Chris? I don't know. off the wall like that. Huh. Here you go. Oh my god. There. Look there, Chris. You can't tell me. You can Whoa, see that. That's, uh, see? That's, uh... You do see it. I don't know. I, 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 I just... <laughs> this is fucking crazy. Chris, it's showing us the way. I feel like the ghost wanted me to see this. What? What? Whoa, 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 what is going on here? Oh, God, it's, it's like... It's not like anything. That's us. <gasps> hiding there, waiting for Hannah, last year. But it's, it's so accurate. I mean, that's exactly where I was sitting, and that's where Matt was. This was set up by someone who was there. Or someone, or something that was watching us. Maybe it's a warning. I think someone... I think someone put this here to mess with us. No, it has to be the ghost. It's trying to tell us the maniac killed Hannah and Beth. I think it's this bastard that he's, he's here trying to fuck with our heads. Why would he set this all up, Chris? He's trying to tell us that he's going to come after us all, too. Oh. Dice! Oh. It's... It's Hannah's diary. Everyone being together here on the mountain is going to be so awesome. Cozy fires and hot tubs and OMG, Mike, I am so psyched to spend some time with him. I can't read this. It's so sad, Chris. What was that? It came from down there. Something, but, but where'd it go? Hey, 
Hey, look at this. It doesn't seem as old as some of the stuff down here. It's a catalog for industrial light bulbs. That is so random. Look, one of the bulbs is circled. Yeah, it's a powerful bulb. Huh. Just when you think it can't get any creepier. Oh! Jeez! anyone make fake newspapers? <laughs> That's a really good question. You know what? No. Ash. No, I've had enough. I'm not going down any further into this nightmare, Chris. Ashley. I understand, okay? I'm really freaked out too, but if Sam's down there all alone with a maniac and we leave, we're basically killing her ourselves. God damn it. Ashley, come on. Why are you always right? I'm not always right. Well, when you're right, you're right. I don't want to be, I want to leave. No, we've got to find Sam. Let's go. Chris, I'm getting a really weird feeling from all this. What do you mean? Well, I just, I can't shake the feeling that those fake newspapers have something to do with the guy who killed Josh. Wait, wait, like, like what? Like it's a setup or something? Yeah, but I mean, how? It's just, it almost makes sense, but it just feels like we're missing something.
That's us. I mean, what is this, like a fucking hit list? Christ. video she's just so so what like, she's so excited it's hannah and alive hey, hannah. she has no idea oh, oh geez oh my god she's wow. taking her shirt off forgot you were such a oh willful participant It's horrible. Uh, Couldn't feel worse. Looks like you were enjoying yourself. That's the worst part, isn't it? We were just playing a joke. It was supposed to be funny. Yeah. I never want to see this video ever again. Oh. Ash, slow down, okay? I can't handle this ghost and these videos and everything just, just flying Just calm down. Around. Listen to me for a what? second. What? Calm down? Why should I calm down, Chris? I am freaking this out right This has got to be someone messing with us. What? Think about it. Ghosts don't hook up video cameras. They don't play games. Then who would set this all up? Seriously, I'm asking. I don't know. Maybe the same person who tied you up and killed Josh? Yeah, right. The same person who might have Sam right now. Maybe you're right. I wish I wasn't. That blood might be Sam's. All right, let me see if I can get this. Yeah, I got it, but oh, damn, this thing is heavy. Be careful. You gotta come through, Ash. I, I can't hold it. Uh, oh, come on, Chris. Which what? I think I just saw Sam over there. Right, Ash, are you sure? I don't know, but come on, I think we should check it out. Yeah, well, I'm pretty sure whoever's bleeding came through here, okay? So we really gotta get moving, like now.
No, I can see that. Why is it dressed up like Sam? I don't know. Why would someone dress up a dummy like Sam? Chris, I don't know, and I'm kind of freaking out. Where the hell is Sam? This is crazy. This is crazy. Oh, oh shit! Oh, no, get back! Stay the hell away from me! Oh, no, 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 no! no. Face off. <laughs> what is this? This is, no, Chris. this is the guy who killed Josh. Oh, God. No, God. You murdered a piece of shit. Oh, you monster. We're gonna die, Chris. I don't think I'm ready to die. No one is going to die. I wish I could tell you. It's just not fair. What? Tell me what. It's too late. Chris, what's the point? Stop it. Just say. We're always talking around it. And now, I mean, we've wasted everything. Actually, none of it was wasted. What do you mean? Every second that I spent with you was the only thing I ever wanted to do with my time. <laughs> what are you saying, Chris? I'm sorry. I, I should have told you how I felt. Chris. Ashley, no. I swear when we get out of this... Oh, God! No. Ashley, I'll get you out of this! I won't let you die! Hello there, my special little subjects. Oh, no. shit. Here, Chris. Don't be scared. Oh, you should be, Ash. Because here's the twist. Chris has made one fatal choice already today. And now, he must make another. Chris... You can take that gun in front of you and shoot Ashley, or you can shoot yourself. Whoever is left can live. The choice is yours. Oh. <laughs> Don't be so silly, Chris. Let me choose to save you. If I do one last thing in my life, let me do this. Chris, please. Oh, oh God. No. Oh, oh God. No! You have gone too far now. Don't you see? Huh? Don't you see that this torture porn has gone too far? Huh? Now what gives you the right to play God in these people's lives? What makes you so special then? Huh? You're sick! You're a sick fuck! Now what the hell have you done to them? Huh? What the hell have you done to them? Psychopath. Psychopath! Wow. 
this is weird. Hey! Guys, come on! Hello? Sam? Oh, God! Chris, the choice is yours. Hello? Thank God, we need help, please! for joining me. Tonight, we're gonna conduct a little experiment. Hello, hello, children. 
No, that's not right. <clears throat> Greetings, pilgrim. Holy shit. Down there, there's a. Oh my! Thank God you found me. It's okay. It's okay. You're okay. Where? Where's Jessica? She's she's not with you. Jessica's dead. What? He killed her, Sam. There's some maniac on the mountain who was trying to kill us, all of us, and I swear to God, when everyone is safe and accounted for, I am gonna hunt that fucker down and rip his nuts off one at a goddamn time. Wow. Listen, this guy who you're talking about, he attacked me. He showed me these videos too. And one of them showed Josh being killed, just ripped apart by this huge fucking saw blade. Jesus Christ. And Mike. I think somehow Josh is involved in all of this. Wait, what? How? I'm really not sure, but there was a message from his doctor, and it mentioned a plan that was like a bad idea, and now he's dead. What the fuck is going on around here? There's a door here. It won't open. Can you unlock it from your side? What are you doing? Well, actually, the towel didn't turn out to be the best outfit for fighting off killer maniacs, you know? Do you mind, Mike? Oh, yeah. uh, right. My bad. Okay. I'm into that. What's that? Is that crying? <sighs> no! No, 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 get away! Oh, Chris. Chris, 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 Chris. What the fuck? You've heard of blanks before. I mean, really? Oh, God. Oh, my 
my foot, man! God! Oh, Jesus! Shit! Oh, shit! Damn it! Ah! be worth it, I look great in that top. All right, now we're talking.
fucking busted elevator's my only way out. Weird. Really weird. On for fuck's sake. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Jesus shit.
Ana. Lovely. Danger is my middle fucking name. was down here.
Josh. <laughs> Josh! <laughs> Josh. Oh, oh, very good. <laughs> Every one of you, you got my name. <laughs> and after all you've been through, good. Good, 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 good. I mean, how does that feel, right? How does it feel? Do you enjoy feeling terrorized, humiliated? I mean, panicked? All those emotions that my sisters got to feel once, one year ago? Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off, no! Nope, no, 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 they're gone! I don't know if you noticed this, Josh, but none of us are laughing. Oh, come, 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 come. Why the long faces? Come on. It's good to get the heart racing every now and then, right? And race, they did. I mean, every one of you just pitter-pat, pitter-pat. I hope you appreciated my little phantasmagorical spectacle. I mean, <gasps> no detail too small. That just no happened. opportunity missed. It was such a delight to play the puppet master to, to all of your Pavlovian panic. <laughs> and all that gore, gore, it was gore galore, fake bodies. I mean, God, that shit was expensive. And no retakes. Nope, 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 only double takes. Oh, you should have seen your faces. Hook, line, and sinker for every little stinker. <laughs> Josh, why are you doing this? Yeah, don't even ask this squirrely little runt. He's got no clue. He's out of his fucking tree. Well, he's definitely off his meds. Oh, come on, you guys. Revenge is the best medicine. You're done. Yeah, Mike, he's sick. What? Come on, you guys are all gonna thank me when you guys become internet sensations. Wait, what, what? Oh, you better believe this little puppy's going viral, ladies and germs. I mean, we got unrequited love. We got, we got blood. I don't think there's enough hard drives in China to, to count all the views we're gonna get, you guys. What are you talking about, you asshat? Jessica's fucking dead. What? Did you hear me? Jessica is dead. You are gonna fucking pay, you ah! dick! Ah! Guys! Guys, come on. Seriously, this is crazy, you know? Shut up. Why'd you hit her, man? Huh? Why'd you have to fucking hit her? Ah! What are you talking you about? You punched Ashley, you piece of shit! Mm. Oh! I got so mad. You don't hit a girl. You, you just don't. Dude, dude, Chris, bro. I, and I'm not your bro. Where are we going? Where are you guys taking me? Locking you up, bro. What? You can't do anything stupid before we call the police in the morning. Come on. I didn't do anything. Are, are you serious, bro? Goddamn murderers, what you are. I didn't do it. Michael, please, just listen to me, man. I did not hurt Jessica. Are, are you insane? Like, 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 really? Do you not understand what you've done? I'm a healer, man! I bring people together! Not like you assholes. That's enough. Want to see? You're not fine. You are ah, dude. Ah, it's not my fault. You suckers can't take a joke. Ugh. Oh, oh wait. Did I hurt you? Did you just you feel a little, a little bit of pain mm. right now? I am so, so ah. sorry. Ah, stop it. Jesus, dude. Stop, Michael. I'm sorry, man. I can't tell you how sorry I am that something happened to Jessica, but I swear. I swear to you, I have no idea what happened to her. Oh, shit, Mike, this... Oh. I don't know, something feels really wrong here, man. Oh. Are you joking? I, I, I'm just having a really hard time at figuring out that he would, like, do anything to her Jess. I saw what he did to her. With my own eyes. This! This! This is her blood. But can't we all just get along? <laughs> ah! Damn it! I'm not dicking around. It's not right. No. This is not how it's supposed to 
to go down. You're just a bunch of bully. You can't hang out a, a guy just to dry like this, guys. Huh? Not like, not like you got the guts to really do anything about it anyways. Ah! Ah! Really, really, really need to shut up, man. Oh. Oh, oh that, that's, a, I, I, I mean, I, I, I don't even know what you mean because I, I don't have anything to regret. Oh my God. Ah! Yeah! Ah! Yeah! Ah! Okay, you're tying me up now, okay? Stay still, right, man. Right, 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 still. Okay, can't tie him up if they just wiggle around. Gosh, dude. I leave me a little wiggle room, huh? What does it take to shut you up? Oh, not so tight, okay? Not so tight, I can't, I can't wiggle around. There's plastic ties, that's where it's... What? In God's name, plastic is he talking plastic about? Plastic this is hard to watch. You ever see this kind of shit before? Oh, I've never, never seen him like or this. Your money back. <laughs> shh, shh, everybody's stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Chris and Ash. Chris is an ass. Ash leaves a dum dum. <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry, what did you say? Well, I said you're a dummy, dummy. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Oh, Ashley. Oh. Ashley, I'll get you out of this. I won't let you die. Oh, I never imagined in my wildest dreams that you liked me. Stop. <laughs> you know what that sound is? It's the sound of never kissing Ashley, you pussy! Stop! Yeah, you know, you might as well let Ashley sleep with Mike. I mean, at least he's got some notches in his belt, you know? He'll treat her right! You're fucking pathetic, Christopher! I'm gonna beat his head off. Don't listen to him. Not worth it. Hey, Mike. Hey, Mike, 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 Mike. Mike. What? What happened with Jess, Mike? You know what happened. No. No, I... I don't. I got a problem, Mike. I don't remember killing Jess. Jesus Christ. No, I mean, like, I feel like I, I would remember killing her, you know? She's so soft. And she's probably got, like, a really tight bod. Shut your fucking mouth! No! Seriously? What, what? Did you think I was gonna shoot him? I... I don't know. Come on, Chris, you know me better than that. Yeah, Chris, you know me better than that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, well, just next time give me a heads up, all right? <gasps> Oh, you poor little piggies. You can't even get your good cop, bad cop routine to work. Leave us to the pros, bros. Why don't you go back to the lodge? Make sure everything's all right. I'll stay here with this lunatic until the morning. Oh, sleepover. <laughs> hey, can we order pizza? <laughs> you sure you're OK? Yeah, they want to know everything's fine back there. Yeah, you're right. See you in the morning. Josh. <laughs> Josh! How does it feel? Do you enjoy all those emotions that my sisters got to feel once, one year ago? Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off. No, nope, no, 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 they're gone. Jessica's fucking dead. What? Did you hear me? Jessica is dead. And you were gonna fucking pay, you ah! dick! What happened with Jess, Mike? I don't remember killing Jess. Jeez. Christ. Oh, God. Oh, my God, Matt.
This is gonna be the way. Shit! Oh,
Let her in quick. <gasps> shut the door! Oh my God! Shut the door! Am, are you all right? I didn't think that I'd make it. You were screaming bloody murder. You, okay? you look totally wise. There was something. Where's Matt? Come sit down. Sit down. Something's out there. Did you there. guys split up? A monster. It's a monster. Wait. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I, I don't feel anything. I just need to calm down. It was moving so damn fast. What? I just had to get away. Away from what? There, there was this, this thing, whatever it was. M -M, you can relax. Josh was messing with You're us. You're not listening to me. M, can you tell us exactly what happened? I am trying to tell you. We were climbing up the tower and it... It fell, the whole tower just fell right into the mines. Whoa, 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 what mines? There are these mine shafts all over running under everything. When the tower fell, we ended up down there. I don't understand, the tower fell? How'd it fall? I, I was walking down there in the mines and it was dark and I found this pile and there was Beth's head. Wait, what? Beth's head, I found oh it. Oh my god. What the fuck? Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. Listen, in in the tower there was there was a radio and I, and I got through to someone, but then that was right when the tower collapsed. Em, you made it. Oh God, yeah, yeah, Mike. barely. What about Matt? We're trying to figure that out. Yeah, and then there was this monster that was chasing her. She's all messed up, guys. Emily, hey Em. Whoa. Who the fuck can that be? Josh. Jess. It's not Jess. Sorry, man, but who is it? I don't know. We should check it out. I got your back. Good. Okay. I'm gonna open the door. You ready? Mm -hmm. You ready? Do it already. Whoever it is is probably gone by now. I, unless you want me to take the gun. No, no, no. I think that's less good. You do the door. I got the gun. <laughs> Hold on there. Hold on there, mister. Freeze. Ah, oh, what? All right, all right. Just take it easy, Grandpa. Okay, everybody, just calm down. Now, nah, just move over there. Go on, move. Let me say what I came to say. I'm here to tell you what you're up against being back on this mountain. You should never have returned. I don't know why you did after what happened last year. You mean with Hannah and Beth? Yeah, how could you know without being involved? Or responsible. You hold on to your horses. I don't take kindly to you kids coming up here to my mountain. Your mountain? Huh? I'm sure the Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> Well, the mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. This mountain belongs to the Wendigo. <laughs> Who? What's he talking about? What the hell's a Wendigo? Let's hear him out. Not like we have a choice. Now, I'm only gonna tell you this once. It doesn't matter to me if you believe it or not. I got reasons I wanna get it off my chest. See? I told you. He's guilty as shit. Guilty as something. Shut up, Mike. There is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh, crap. gonna need to find somewhere safe. The basement might be okay. Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? Until dawn. Guys, I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Ah, uh, your friend will already be dead. No, no, he, he can't be. I, we, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No. I'm gonna go get him. You can't go out there, Chris. I'm supposed to be his best friend, and, and, and I let him down. No, he let you down, Chris. He let all of us down. I don't care. I'm going to get him. 
Then I'll go with you. I, I don't need your help. Hey, going alone is suicide. Fine. The rest of you, get down to the basement. Be safe. And don't go outside again until we're back. You don't seem to understand the magnitude of the situation. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Uh, yeah, I think so. You need to follow me and do everything I tell you. This is the end. You point towards the thing you want to kill. I know how to use a shotgun, man. No, you don't. What? How do you know? Trust me, I know. Hey, come back safe. Come on, we need to hurry, son. I, uh, see you soon. So, so, so tell me, you're the expert on these things. I, what's, uh, what, what's a guy gotta know? You just be careful. You follow my lead. So, how many times do I have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead? Well, you'll be shooting it a long time. You, you mean this thing won't even kill it? No, but it'll slow it down. Well, how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They fear it, and it can kill them if you have to. See, their skin is like... It's like tough armor, unless you burn it off first. It's gross. Well, what, what are these things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable, or... I mean, can you figure out what they're gonna do? Well, they adhere to some patterns, like any animal or human. What, you mean, like how? Like they've got schedules? Well, they only hunt at night. Oh. Why? I didn't ask. Any, uh, pro-Wendigo tips? Like if I rub garlic all over me, they won't be able to smell me or something? Oh, they'll still smell you. Anything like that? They can't see you if you're standing still. It's like toads. <laughs> Sight is based on changes of movement in their field of vision. So if I don't move, I, I'm, I'm basically invisible. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't recommend testing it out. Unless you have no other choice. If these things, uh, Wendigos, are or, or were human, do they, do they still have some aspect of humanity in them? Well, they retain certain things. I mean, is it really right to kill them? <laughs> Maybe they could be cured or not. <laughs> they surrender human rights the moment they eat one another. There's no cure, there's no redemption. I, I, I mean, if they're still human, I don't know if it's right to hurt them. When you're staring one in the face, it's them or you. You feel free to take the high road. You won't be on it for long. Oh. Damn it! Josh, he could still be out there. <laughs> First, the Wendigo. He'll render you immobile. And then he strips the skin off of your entire body, piece by piece. And then he keeps you alive and aware and feasts on your organs, one piece at a time. 
So the lodge then. Yeah. Let's go now. It might still be near. Forget it. Oh, jeez. so good up there right now understatement of the night chris where's the flamethrower guy uh yeah he uh he didn't make it no what happened the thing it uh, tore him apart right in front of me oh god all right these are all the doors yeah are you sure what are you looking for another way out mike look i really don't think that's a good idea we should stay put right here until dawn at least we're safe down here. Oh, yeah? All wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top for that thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning? People will come for us in the morning. You don't sound so sure. That is what'll happen, right, Em? Yeah, I, I mean, right? Well, you can wait. I'm leaving. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. Josh? One of his dirty little tricks. Great, great. If that fucking thing got a hold of Josh, then we're shit out of luck. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. Em? What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. 
And what is all that? It's uh, that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. What is this place? Oh, my God. Wait, wait, wait. What is that? I was down there. It's horrible. You were? There had been a cave-in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. Oh, my God. Some of them survived, but like 15 of them didn't make it. There was this reporter, and I think he figured out there had been some like big cover-up going on. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody had been tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're going to get the fuck out of here, please. I'm just saying, it's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Um. Um, what is that? Huh? What is that? Ash. Um, oh my god, oh my god, it's, oh it's my nothing. god. It's oh nothing, no, it just, oh it, no, it bit no. me and... It bit you? What bit you? Uh, the, the Wendigo. The what? It's nothing, really, it's not a big deal. You okay? Shit. It doesn't hurt anymore, really, it's, it's not that bad. Em, if that thing bit you... I, I know what you're thinking, and I'm fine. Are you? Yes. Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you... You could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said so, that. Is that how it works? Yes. It happens. If it bit you, you're going to turn into one, and then you're going to turn on us. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You can't be down here with us. What? Mike. You got to go. Are you kidding me? You're putting us all in danger. Like hell I am. Emily. You can't stay here. Mike, just cool your head, okay? We don't know if it works like that. Maybe it's just a bite. I've seen what these fuckers can do, and I don't want to say it again. What is this? Guys, what are you doing? Door's right here. I am letting you do this voluntarily. Oh, no, you're just making yourself feel better about sending me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with... Okay, oh my god, will you just go? Go, get out of here! Whoa, okay. Whoa, 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 Mike, calm down. You're... you're gonna shoot me? Mike, me? This is the safe room, M. Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. <laughs> not for us. Don't, don't do this! I'm really sorry. Fuck, I can't do this. Oh my god. You did the right thing. I hope you did. Maybe. For now. Shit. Fuck, fuck. Keep an eye on her. If you see anything weird, you guys know what to do. Yeah. No one leave. Okay? It's not safe out there. I'll be back soon. I thought that, that he was gonna help us. With a flamethrower, dude? Now we don't have a chance. No, guys, it just means we've gotta be tough. We've gotta do this on our own. I don't know if I can. What does it say? It 
it says that the bites, it, if it bites you, it's not infectious. It doesn't do anything. Let me see uh, that. I'm sorry, what did you say? Um, it says she'll be okay. It says what? You're gonna be fine. Fine? Michael almost shot me, is that he fine? He didn't shoot you. And this bitch almost let him. Hey, that's not fair, she was scared. I'm the one who's scared. I, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Emily. I didn't know what was going to happen. There's None of us know. There's no excuse, there's no excuse please, for Emily, this. Emily, please, just try to understand. Understand the palm of my hand, bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. We've gotta get to Mike. Like, now. Joshua, you should have listened to me. Because of your choices, people have died. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death, or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. Remember last year, huh? Are you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help them. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear, while a real threat was closing in. No, it's all about you, Josh. It's always all about you. Your game has gone terribly wrong. And your friends, like your sisters, have deserted you. You're all alone. Can you feel how cold your loneliness has become, huh? Why did you hurt them? Joshua, why did you hurt them? But they didn't hurt you, Joshua. Not intentionally. They made a stupid mistake, and a terrible tragedy befell your sisters. I did not intend for that to happen. It just did. And they were sorry, at least, until you subjected them to your night of horrific torture. Just a game? But it's a game that has driven you to one of your own deepest fears, Joshua. Isolation. Oh my god, guys, thank god! What took you so long? It's not so good up there right now. Uh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh, quiet. Uh, yeah, he, uh... Wait! What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. And what is all that? It may have taken him down to the mine. I was down there. It's horrible. You've been a cave in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. Um, what is that? Huh? This is the safe room, M. Please. Fuck, I can't do this. Oh. You did the right thing. Keep an eye on her. I'll be back soon.
shit. Huh. What happened on the walls? I just need a pitchfork and a mob. Ah, good enough. You see me again, huh? Hey. I was hoping I'd run into you again. All right. Good boy. All right, pal. You're coming with me. All right. Here's the plan. I happen to see a map of this place, so we're not flying blind. There should be a way through the psychiatric wing that'll take us right outside the mine. Think you can handle that? Couldn't have said it better myself. Ah, boy. Doggy boy, calm down. Wish I could move like you, Wolfie. I'm stuck on this side. All right. 
There goes nothing. Awesome. Got moves. Don't I, Wolfie? Doors were built like tanks. How crazy were these inmates? Fuck, man. This is truly disgusting. What went on here? This is nuts.
hot sauce Christmas cake. This is fucking unbelievable. Sorry, Alter.
you son of a bitch. Where are you? Huh? Damn it. What the? What? Time, boys. It's enough for me for all ya. Oh shit.
Hey, buddy. Come on down. It's all right. Okie dokie, bud. Hey, I'll catch you on the flip side, huh? Guys, hurry up! We gotta find Mike! Come on! Hey... I'm, I'm, I'm kind of gimping out here, guys. Um, I think maybe you should go on without me. No! Chris, we are not leaving you. We're sticking together. Mike will just have to wait. Mike must have locked it behind him. Crap! There's got to be another way in. this I mean should, should we try it oh, it's not like we got a whole lot of choices here
Okay, this is maybe the last place I would want to be right now. So who's going first? <laughs> After you. It's not so bad. You think this is the tunnel to the sanatorium? Of course it is. Where else would it go? Chris, I know you're hurt, but you gotta move it, all right? I'm trying, Ash. Hey, um... Hey, we should close this, right? Huh? I mean, what if something's following us? Yes, fine, close it. But we gotta keep moving. Can you just catch up, please? Yeah. Who's there? Anybody? Jessica! Is it you? Hello? God, I am so glad to see you. Glad you're safe. Look. Look there. Wow, great. <gasps> the ladder's toast. We're never gonna make it up there. No, 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 I think I can. I think I can do it. It's like a rock wall. I'm gonna keep going. You should head back to the lodge. I've gotta get Mike. Good luck. I beat you. I fucking beat you.
Huh. Okay, then. Hello?
That's it. That's it. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Any marshmallows? Whoa, you all right? Uh, to find all right. Alive for a start. Let's find a way down to where this fucker lives. Emily! Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's gotta have it. Ah, uh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh, quiet. It may have taken him down to the mine. Wait. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. That's it. That's it. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Run! Let's find a way down to where this fucker lives. I wonder how much these sessions are of any help to you now. Just want to listen to me and think seems pretty... Fucked up. So I I'm gonna leave you now, Josh. It's time you learn. There's more to be afraid of that can be dreamt up by the unhinged imagination of a self-indulgent, spoiled little brat! You had so many people who cared about you, who were willing to help! But at every turn, you choose to push them away, and now you're all alone. <laughs> but by the sounds of things, you won't be alone for long. No, you won't be alone for long. Deep breaths, Josh. Deep breath. No. 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 Not again. Not again. Get away! Get away! Uh, get away from me! No! You're dead! Sorry. You're dead! Shut up! Oh! Uh, no! You're dead! That's not ready. You manipulate. No. You are oh, a coward. They're gonna love it. If one is there, they're gonna love it. That's right. Don't take words from you. You can't. You can't tell me what to do. You can't tell me what to do anymore. Oh, okay. Okay. I trust you. I trust you. I trust you. No. 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 You're not real. We were all alone down there. No, 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 not again.
all alone. But you're with us now. Family. Get away from me! Get away! Why didn't you save us, Josh? Why did you want us to die? I didn't want you to die. I swear. old pictures of some guys with that scar and he was transforming into a wendigo i'm kidding it's one of the miners who've been trapped back in the 50s in the cave-in which means that thing is 80 years old at least spunky for an old timer they cleaned the place out killed a lot of people they you mean there are more of them oh yeah how many too many Close to the lair. How can you tell? I don't know. I just feel really terrible all of a sudden. Did I? Sharks or anything in here. Sharks? Great. Thank you. Oh, 
shit. This looks like Hannah's writing. survive anymore. If someone finds this, I'm sorry. I had to. I had no choice. What does it mean? Jesus. died in the fall. So what? What does that mean? So Hannah must have buried her. God damn it. God damn it. Hannah was down here. I don't believe any of this! She would have been starving. She would have been desperate. Fuck! We need to find Josh. Right now. I trust you. Oh! 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 He's tripping or something. Josh! M M Mike. Josh! Hey, man. Don't, don't hit me, please, please, please. Well, you were deep in it, man. Full mental jacket. We didn't think we'd get you back. Josh, Hannah was down here for weeks, a month. She dug Beth up. Sam. Mike. Hey, let's just get the fuck out of here. Okay. Josh, do you have the key for the cable car? Uh, yeah. Here. Oh, God. 
see that over there? That means there's a direct way out. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> there's no way Josh is gonna make it up there. Okay. If you help me up, I can go back to tell the others we're okay. Yeah. Yeah, good. You bring Josh back the way we came, and we'll all meet at the lodge. Be careful. Yeah, you too. <sighs> Alright, let's go, you fucked up son of a bitch. You didn't have to hit me so much, man. Uh, yeah, um, I'm sorry about before, man. I, I thought you killed Jess. I was wrong. How did you end up down here? Mike and I were... We were messing around and... And then it... It was... What? I don't... I don't know. I was by the window and there was all this glass and... It was in the snow and then it was moving so fast. Fuck. And then I was um, just down here. Oh, God. Can you move? Yeah. Come on, Jess. Look at that. 
some sort of cave in here. It was me. What? I fell through that roof. You fell this far? Jesus. It makes two of us. When? I fell off a goddamn fire tower down here. You're kidding me.
You look terrible. It's gonna look worse if we stay out here. Come on. How do you rate our chances of survival? Hmm? I'm trying not to think about it. Oh, go, go, go! Oh, my God! Run!
structure is completely destroyed. Over. Hold on. I'm seeing something. It looks like there are survivors. Let's pick them up. Describe him. I mean, you said you thought he was stalking you at first. Did anyone else in your group think that? Well, yeah. We... <laughs> Is it possible they could have killed him? What? No. No, you, you, you don't understand. Don't you understand? And if he attacked you, he saved my life. And I watched him die. I heard Jessica. I don't know how or why she was down there, but I know I heard her. He held it right up to my face. Right here, right in front of my nose, and he could have shot me. He almost shot me, the prick. I mean, you go out with a guy for however long, and you think you know him, but man, this one really takes the cake. I was right there, and I could have done something. I tried to do something. It wasn't good enough. How did you end up in the mines? I was carried and taken and... What did you see? I don't know. I don't, I don't know. He was out of his fucking mind. He wanted to hurt us. Okay? And I thought he was the one who attacked Jess. I thought we were close. After his sisters disappeared, he'd come and talk to me. He said I was the only one who understood him. I thought... I thought we had a connection. If you need someone to talk to... I'm fine. Sometimes? After a traumatic experience... I said I'm fine. I... I stabbed him, and I tried to get away, but I didn't know. I swear I didn't know. Didn't know? Who did you stab? Oh, I, I, I stabbed the maniac. I didn't know it was Josh, but then he was the psycho. And how was I supposed to know Josh had all the saws and the gun and... Oh, my God. You bringing in Meat Brain next? Gonna kick him around a bit for me? I'm sorry? Meat Brain, Mr. Muscle Brawn, Matt the Incredible Sulk. Is there something we need to know? Oh, no, nothing important except, um, you know, how he basically left me to die up on a freaking tumbling tower like a world-class douche nozzle? Your friend Ashley, she told us she tried to help you. <sighs> she said she heard you calling out. <sighs> Not me. Mike. What do you remember? He came for me. He did. Came for you? Where is he? Did he make it? You need to listen to me. I don't care if you believe me or not. It doesn't matter because you will. You need to go down to the mines. What's in the mind, Sam? I've seen what's down there. And I'd give anything to unsee it. Survivor, repeat. Is that? Oh, fuck! Stay back! Stay back! No, no, no! Ah! 